In the previous Metapipe version, we need to separate the body and the head, as well as the eye. But now we don't need it. Let's do it. Open your start scene. And after that, press load DNA button. And import the body and the eye. Now select the body and the eye and press the joint transform button. Before we save the DNA files, let's import the metahuman teeth that we modified. Remember, this is the metahuman teeth, not a custom one. We will do that on the next video, How Add Your Custom Teeth. Go to Window, Animation Editor, Shape Editor and open it. Select the teeth and create blend shapes. While the teeth are selected, duplicate it and add selection as a target. And set the value to negative one. Now import the modified teeth, add selection as a target and make the value 1. Now save DNA. No, we'll click the toggle button and click the prepare to export. Make sure that you don't have any selection on the viewport and press build body button. Now select the body, press the build body again and choose fix pose. After that, press Fix Pose again and choose Arms and Legs since we do not want to affect the head area. Assign your material usually. On the Metapipe Export settings, open it and uncheck the objects that you don't want to export. That's all. Thank you. So here are the updates of the course. This is a common problem for jaw movement that needs fixing. Before and after. Before, after. A common problem on how to fix your eye blink, especially on the character, has a big eye. How to add your custom teeth and fix those weird deformations. How to add your custom hair and add physics to your custom hair. And finally, by adding your custom eyebrow, let's talk what are the limitations of Metapipe in this kind of scenario, like the brow and eyelash geometry. So stay tuned, there will be more updates to come for free updates who already have purchased the course. Please write on the Discord channel which one you struggle with most, so in the next update I will cover it. Thank you for your support and please don't forget to like and subscribe and please do a rating on the course itself if you think it's helpful for you. It means a lot to me. Thank you and God bless us all.